Rockin' with that chest, not Jeffers TV, cake ass. Now, Rich. Lil' Bill, showin' 20s on Pirelli skills. Got your bitches dilated like the mixed fields. No time to stop, focus on that on the meal. Man, so the boy Errol Spencer, Terrence Crawford, had the fight last night, man. I know everybody done seen it by now. Anyway, man, welcome to Ballin' in the Mix Sports Talk, man. Boy BC in the place to be, you feel me? Um, man, that boy face is fucked up, man. Man, that boy Terrence Crawford face look like he just came out the barbershop, man. Man, that nigga line up, edge up, beard, edge up. That nigga look like he just had a fresh, and put some lotion on his face, cologne on. That nigga, <laughs> that nigga look like he fresh come out the barbershop. Air Spence look like he got bit in the face by 17 pit bulls, man. That boy shit fucked up. But uh, one thing I noticed about this fight, man, um, a couple days before, a week or two before the fight, your boy Air Spence. Was all on million dollars worth of game. He doing all kind of interviews and shit. You know what I'm saying? I ain't seen that boy Terrence Crawford at all, man. That boy in the gym. You know what I'm saying? He working out. Eric Spence running around being a celebrity and shit. Should have had his ass up in that gym for them last two weeks, man. I know. I understand he going on the press run to try to boost the fight, and make more money. But shit. That boy Terrence Crawford in that motherfucking gym punching them bags and shit and sparring and, and running and weightlifting and all that shit while he on a million dollars worth of game and shit. Uh, I think that's where it went wrong right there, man. I, I think Errol Spence kind of figured like, man, I got this nigga. Uh, you know what I'm saying? He didn't really think shit was going to end up how it ended up. But it ended up how it ended up, man. I'm talking about the whole fight, man. The shit. Only thing I seen was uh, Bud Crawford motherfucking glove in Errol Spence's mouth. That's all I seen the whole fight. Like, boom, boom. Like, goddamn. It's like, you know how you, know how you uh, back in the day, if you know somebody who really had hands, first of all, I don't give a fuck how good you can fight. I don't give a fuck how good you can fight. It's somebody out there in the world that can whoop that ass. You know what I'm saying? Look at Mike Tyson. <laughs> Shit, look at Errol Spence. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't know if you ever seen somebody from your neighborhood who been knocking niggas out. They been beating niggas up real bad. Then when they finally met they match, it looked like that they couldn't even fight. You know what I'm saying? It looked like that was their first time having a fight, man. That's what happened to Errol, man. But, you know... That boy just got to get back up in the gym, man. His trainers, man, I hope they took notes of what was going on. He talking about he had an off night. Nah, nigga. There wasn't nothing off about that night. What was on was Terrence Crawford's glove was on your nose. That hoe was on your face. Yeah, that's what was going down, man. But anyway, man, Bottle in the Mix Sports Talk, man. We're going to come back with more and more as we do. More and more. OGBC, man, we got.